Good afternoon, YouTubers. This is Neil Neil's Coins. Quick video, I hope. It's going to probably be in a little bit longer than I want. But anyway, the last couple of videos, I've been going through some Morgan dollars. Now, second from the last video, I found an 1878 Morgan dollar. It ended up being an eight tail feather variety. Well, that's kind of rare to find in itself in a bag of coins. So I'll just kind of I just kind of just put it to the side. Uh, this coin, this is the coin I found. This coin ain't in a very uh, best shape. It's probably a VF25. Got a couple ram dings. I just kind of just set it to the side because, you know, I wasn't, didn't even dawn on me to think about what kind of varieties because this coin this year coin uh eight tail feather and the seven tail feather and the eight over seven there's just so many varieties they're like 250 i mean i was crazy how many varieties they are and um so i got it out just looking at it last night and i noticed that the maker's mark there's a maker mark on the back of all the coins there's one on the front and the back. The one that's on the back. All right. There. Is an M in the loop of the bow. And it's sideways. It's real tiny. And you can only see one half of it. And then on the front. There's one right. There. You see how defined that one is. On the one on the back, uh, I don't know, it's it's just not struck well. So I said, well, that's got to be some sort of variety. That's what got my search um, going. So I went over here to you to or to Van World, and I found the variety that had that mistake well then it showed me to look for some other things to verify uh like there's some extra material right here on the extra feathers the set the eight tail feathers have a little bit more feathers here and here uh and then a little bit different on in god we trust and the end god is touching this side if you look at the later ones they're everything's tighter there's less room in between they squeezed everything up and then it showed you go on the well let me do this it told me to look right here for a die crack you can barely see it since the coins wore it goes through the d across here across the s i don't know what that is in the s it's probably some garbage but you can barely see it due to the uh coin condition and then on the front it told me to look for a little bit of an eye spot which is there and there's without you may not see it but without high magnification but there's some polished lines right in here and you may be able to see this one. This one's kind of... All right. There's a vertical polish line right there. Uh, and then in the ear is a spot. You probably can't see it without high magnification. Anyway, what this ended up being is a VAM 9. Uh, I'm going to set the coin down and come over to my trusty blue laptop here. All right, this is what got my, the original, let's zoom out. The original reason I got started was because here's that M. It's kind of hard to operate to. All right, you see the M's not quite defined, and yet you can see that side. So that's what got me on my search that's how i found it uh now 
here's that here's that extra material kind of bold that's supposed to be there but it's got more material on it there's the lines that I was pointing out there's that line that was in her hair uh, more of the same the eye a little bit of an eye spot the dot in there anyway bam nine now if you go up here and read now I'm going to try to do this. It's kind of hard to read through the phone. I'm going to kind of hold it still. If you want to pause that and read it, let me go back. Right now, you can go back and read it. But what it basically says, it's the first dice. So that coin is one of the first ones ever minted. First die pair, Morgan Dollar, eight tail feather variety, um, struck. At 3.17 p.m. March 11, 1878. So they know exactly what time they started. The combination of the dies, uh, the errors that I showed you on the front and the back, pretty much identifies this coin, what it does. But this is a cool thing. I ought to be more exciting, excited than this. Um, the first coin struck as presentation pieces for President Ruther B. Hayes. Ruther B. Hayes, uh, the 19th president, blah, blah, blah. Uh, he's quantity of, of these van varieties. According to records, president, or not president, according to record, president, only struck, only 303 pieces were struck so there's only 303 of them you know struck uh which was the the, the die had failed after that um anyway it's one of his presidential pieces not presidential presentation pieces. Uh, I can't even talk this this afternoon. Yeah, three hundred, three hundred three pieces were struck that are known. Now on PCGS, I went over there. Let's see if I can do this. Uh, bam. All right, if you go to that coin, go back, go to that coin. Just bear with me. This thing's slow. Go to varieties. Come on. All right. Now you go over here. Go to VAM 9. It says first die pair. Click on that. All right. It don't give you no values come on it don't give you any values but if you look at the auction records here's one in a vf30 that's real close to one i have of course those are just last year 264 dollars auction record all right if you step the grade up to extra fine look at that 1200 dollars 700 dollars And a AU-53. Of course, mine ain't that great. So let's go back. I think it's a 25. And a 25. 
one sold of course these are old old dates one sold uh, you know three hundred five hundred dollars you get the right person in the room when it goes you know on auction let's see what ebay i like this ebay records uh there's Uh, all these are not eBay, are they? Anyway, pretty much the same thing. Oh, I just added right here at eBay records, 400, 300, 500. So mine, so that one sold on eBay for $488. That's crazy. Anyway, I should be very excited. Let's go back to my trusty stand here without smashing the wrong button well i found one one of 303 preservation present i can't even talk blah, blah, blah. preservation pieces for the president in a bag of coins i did find some other varieties but I'm definitely going to have to send this one off and have it graded. It does, like I said, it ain't in the best shape, but you've seen what the VF20s were going for. That dang air is going to hurt it. Uh, being cleaned is going to hurt it. Uh, anyway, I wanted to share that with y'all. All that in one bag of coins. Uh, Anyway, if you like this video, like, subscribe, share it. If you got any questions, uh, if you want to buy this coin, let me know. Uh, if you see anything in this video, any, anything in my videos that you may be interested in, just let me know. Uh, send me an email. Everything I've got pretty much is for sale. There's a few things that I won't sell, but anyway, thought I'd share it with you. Y'all, uh, like, subscribe, and all that stuff again, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.